Stringent security measures have been put in place at Aden Abdullah International Airport in the Somali capital Mogadishu, where a Djibouti-bound plane was punched a large hole in its fuselage by a blast earlier this year. The measures include a round-the-clock security surveillance system, physical checkpoints, electronic detention systems, and rigorous passenger luggage and cargo screening. Sniffer dogs will also be used and firearms completely banned within airport premises. I frequently travel to Somalia. In the last few months, I have witnessed a lot of improvements in security, and there are many well-trained staff serving passengers using the airport. In February, a blast punched a large hole in the field lodge of a Djibouti-bound passenger plane shortly after it took off from the airport. It was forced to make an emergency landing, and one person was sucked out of the plane and died. It is so far unclear which group is behind the explosion, but Mogadishu has long been a target of Islamist group Al-Shabaab. In March, Aden Abdullah International Airport recorded the arrival of some 7,800 international passengers and over 5,500 international departures.